How's it going, YouTube? Uh, in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how you can uh, downgrade your um, 4.1, 4.2.1 devices down to 4.1. This is mostly for you guys that are on like an MC model device and uh, want to jailbreak it. Uh, so let's go ahead and open up settings, and I'm gonna show you guys that I am running a 4.2.1 device. Uh, and it's MC. Go ahead and make sure you reference the uh, serial number so you can um, compare it with the one at the end of the video, so you know I'm not switching anything out. And then uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. So uh, make sure you guys have um, downloaded the Snowbreeze and the 4.1 IPSW file for your device. Those links are in the description. Go ahead and open up Snowbreeze and just click OK. And then go ahead and uh, click um, click the close credits and uh, just continue on through. As you can see, it's version 2.1. Here we're going to search for uh, the 4.1 IPSW file we just downloaded. Um, It'll probably make sure you have it so saved somewhere that you can uh, locate later, and then just click OK, and then uh, Snowbreeze is gonna do its thing, and then just click Next. As you, it'll give you a message saying IPSW verified. So what we're gonna choose is uh, Expert Mode, and then just go ahead and do that, and click Next. Then you can select General, and then go ahead and click Next. And then uh, it's, you're gonna have some options on the side like enabling backgrounding, uh, wallpaper, or uh, battery percentage. The only thing I want to do is uh, battery percentage, so just go ahead and click next. Once you've decided, you can also add custom maps. I don't have anything to add there. And then just go ahead and click build IPSW and cl uh, click next. And it's gonna make your custom 4.1 firmware. It should probably take about five minutes. Once it's done, we're gonna go ahead and go into the jailbreak part of this. So. First, what we have to do is turn off our devices. So just uh, hold the power button and uh, slide the power off. So once it's uh, once it's done that, just go ahead and click start and get ready to hold the power and hold button on your item on your device. Make sure you hold them at the same time. You're gonna hold them for about 10 seconds. And uh, just a warning, guys, it's gonna ask you to release the power button and. Um, continue holding the home button so get ready for that so once you do that release the power button hold that home button probably for about 10 more seconds it does say 30 but you're only gonna hold it for like 10 more seconds and then uh, once you hear like a sound on your computer like a ding 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 or something like that that means you're in DFU mode and then you can go ahead and release the um, home button and uh, once you do that you're gonna get uh, IREB running that's just gonna get you set up so you can uh, put the custom firmware in. Okay, uh, just go ahead and click OK when you get that notification. Make sure um, iRev is completely done. Also, you're gonna get iTunes popping up. So once you're done with that, go on iTunes. It's gonna tell you, you have a device in recovery mode. Just click OK. And uh, now we're gonna get ready to put the custom firmware on our device. So hold the Shift button and uh, click Restore. And don't worry about that warning. Just click OK. And we're gonna search for uh, for that custom firmware. It's probably gonna be on your desktop. It's gonna be uh, called Snowbreeze 4.1. That's what you're gonna have the title of. So right there, I have Snowbreeze 4.1. So just go ahead and click Restore and um, let iTunes iTunes run its course. Uh, it took about five minutes for me. So once it's done, you're gonna get a message from uh, from iTunes. Don't worry about that. Just let your device keep running. And then uh, iTunes is gonna do its thing to restore it, and you're gonna get a, you're gonna get this warning on your device. Um, you might have to set, you might have to set your iPod up. I didn't have to, so I uh, just go ahead and slide to unlock. And let me go ahead and show you that it is jailbroken, so you can see I do have Cydia right there. Oh, too close. Sorry about that. Cydia, and then let's go ahead and I'll go ahead and show you that it is uh, on on uh, 4.1, and uh, same device. You can. Compare it to uh, this, the model on the serial number at the beginning. Oh, come on, sorry about that, guys. So I'll go ahead and click General, and then uh, About. You guys can verify that you're on 4.1. You can see I'm on 4.1. It's still the MC model. Serial numbers match up. Okay, and let me go ahead and open up City. CD is going to take a few minutes to reorganize, and actually I'm not on uh, Wi-Fi, so we'll go ahead and skip that part. And yeah guys, as you can see, it's uh, Joe Broken. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and let me know if you want anything else. So thanks for watching guys.